Todd, so close to uh, getting something out of the game uh, tonight. Um, but how pleased were you with the resilience that your team showed again and again in this game? Yeah, I mean, obviously, um, we've had our own issues this season, which has been to great disappointment for many people. Um, you know, I, I thought over the entire weekend, uh, I, I feel I feel pretty bad for the guys. They played incredibly tough um, and incredibly well, especially how banged up they are and how short-staffed we are right now. Um, and you know what? Obviously, we were stretched pretty thin towards the end of that third period there, and we were hanging on. I thought that, just like we were talking about before we started rolling, uh, at the Goche goal, um, it seemed to be quite a good turning point for us. Um, but the game opened up and, uh, you, you know, we were punished for a late mistake and it's unfortunate. Uh, the guys are incredibly disappointed. You did concede goals in the first uh, 10 minutes of the first period and an early one at the beginning of the second. Uh, were those poor starts in the period ultimately what was led to the defeat tonight? Well, I think, no, I mean, I think that certainly the second period, um, especially in that long change, if you get hemmed in there, it's very difficult to get out of that out of that zone, and they can continue to change on top of you. Um, and we we're aware of it, but um, y you know we need to be better at the start of periods. As far as the first goes, I thought we were quite engaged, uh, especially um, at the pace of play. I mean that was a that was a a, a couple gears up from last night's game, um, and we adjusted well. Although you you saw how fast those goals developed. Um, and, y y you know, I know the guys felt a little sh shell-shocked, but when we got our first, um, it brought them back within touching distance, and, and the guys, you know, got that belief back, and we kept chipping away at them. Uh, finally, so the, the results aren't going your way at the moment, but tonight it looks like your uh, guys are together. It looks like the team spirit is still very much there. Um, what do you need to do as a team to turn these results around now in the next few weeks? Well, I mean, I think, y y you know, it is a process and, and we made some key adjustments um, this week that will hopefully, um, y you know, start producing results. Um, you, you can't just switch on playing the right way and expect it to magically happen. This is this is going to be a, a, a process that they're going to have to continue for the rest of the season. Um, and ultimately, we're taking a lot of heat from uh, a lot of angles right now and you know some of it justified maybe some a bit harsh but um, you know I try to protect the guys I take a lot on my shoulders and, and make sure that they do have that level of insulation and just have that belief in their game because we are a good club um, once we get healthy here down the stretch um, hopefully we can pop our way back into a playoff spot and uh, and, a, and a strong run in from there.